Octane brings the power of physically accurate, unbiased rendering to your Unity projects. Your Unity scenes can now be rendered interactively in the Octane PBR viewport while you develop your lighting, textures, surface materials, and camera effects. The settings in the PBR render target allow you to switch between rendering cameras, and you can set the rendering kernel to direct lighting, path tracing, PMC, or diagnostic render info channel modes. The info channel modes can visualize the scene in any a number of different ways, including ambient occlusion, Z-depth, material ID, shading normals, texture coordinates, object ID, and more. Octane also gives you the power to render passes of your scene so that render elements such as emission, direct and indirect diffuse lighting, specular reflections, refractions, post-processing, and other passes can be tuned interactively in the PBR viewport or exported for compositing. You can export individual frames from the PBR viewport or all of your desired passes at once using a single dialog box. Images can be saved as 8 or 16-bit PNG or EXR file formats. The PBR render target settings give you complete control of the look of your render. Add post-process effects such as bloom or glare and use the imager settings to adjust exposure and gamma and add color response presets based on real world cameras. You can also add vignetting effects and adjust the white point and saturation as well as other effects to develop your own unique look for your rendered images. The Octane camera can render panoramic images using spherical, cylindrical, and cube mapping for virtual and augmented reality projects. Stereo images can be generated easily using any of the presets that are built into Octane. Octane stereo rendering settings are simple and fast and can be adjusted to match the specific requirements of your virtual reality projects. You can use Unity standard materials and lights in your Octane renders, and these can be edited using the inspector. But the real power of Octane is unleashed when you incorporate the Octane materials into your scene. You can apply Octane materials to your scene assets and then edit the materials using the advanced Octane node graph editor. Physically based specular refractions, reflections, emissive surfaces, subsurface effects, and volumetric materials are all available through the node graph, as well as Octane's powerful procedural textures, displacement, and advanced mapping tools. And these can be combined to render your Unity scene at cinematic quality. Octane for Unity can import and export the Orbix file format. For example, this volumetric cloud, which was exported from Octane standalone, can be imported into the Unity project and edited within Unity. Orbix files exported from any of the 25 Octane plugins used in programs such as Maya, Cinema 4D, 3ds Max, Houdini, Blender, and so on, can become part of your Unity projects rendered with Octane. Octane's built-in recorder feature can be used to render image sequences based on camera and game animation, including animations created using Cinema Machine. You can also use Recorder to export an animated Orbix file sequence that can be rendered in Octane standalone or on the cloud using Otoy's Orc render service. Thanks for watching and we hope you enjoy using Octane within Unity. For more information, please visit unity.otoy.com.